30 with Chief Meteorologist Jesse Walker. Hey everybody, here's a live look with our Graber Post building cam over in Effingham, Illinois. Got some cloud cover mixed with some sunshine over that way. Kind of like everybody else around the area. We've seen the clouds and some sunshine here and there. There's better chances of more clouds the farther north you go. Speaking of clouds, we don't see as much in the tropical Atlantic Basin. There's a system down here we'll have to watch. But other than that, things have kind of quieted down for the time being out there in the tropical Atlantic. Of course, remember last week it was really busy out there, but everything is kind of quieted down. We even had K there off the Baja California coast which brought some rain and also some cooler weather to the southern portion of California. Here at home, we ought to be at 81. Look at this. We only hit 72 for the daytime high. That was it. We dropped down to 51 early this morning. We'll be close to that again tomorrow morning. Now, no rain at the station, but a few places, especially the farther north and northeast, you go picked up a few scattered showers today, but mostly it was farther north and northeast. While by Sherman Terre Haute, 3.7 feet, it is currently stationary. So tonight, clouds now, but the clouds will be clearing out some as the night wears on. Cool tonight as well, much like last night, but a gradual warming trend and dry weather. And I think this dry weather pattern is going to last for a while. So if you need to get some yard work done, things like that, you ought to be in pretty good shape. Terre Haute right now at the airport, we're at 66, but the wind west at about 10. And notice the pressure's down, 2984 is a big area of low pressure spinning around north of here. Temperatures? 61 Crawfordsville, 62 in Danville. Clouds are thicker up there, down to the south, a little bit warmer, lower 70s across our southern counties. As we look into the day for tomorrow, it's going to be another beautiful day. This is the heat index, what it will feel like. Look at that, only in the mid 70s. So if you got something to do outside tomorrow, beautiful weather. There's our big weather maker, big low pressure spinning around here, not moving very quickly, but it's keeping some cloud cover and the cool weather here. But look to the west. There's just nothing going on way out to the west of this area. So we're in good shape once we kick this out of here. And that's going to happen as the night wears on. Uh, you take a look at the Dorsa Automotive Doppler radar, maybe a spotty little shower here, there, but more so off to the northeast of the Indianapolis area. But we can't run out a spotty shower early this evening, especially north and east. But the clouds will tend to clear out as the night goes on tomorrow. Looking for at least partly sunny skies, if not mostly sunny at times. And then during the day Wednesday, look at this. More sunshine moves into the area, and temperatures are going to be gradually warming up as we head through the week. And we're going to be staying dry. This is longer term now. Watch what happens as we take you through the end of the week, into the upcoming weekend, and all the way into Monday. I mean, we just don't see anything. So it's a good stretch of weather headed our way. And cool weather now. But that's going to be changing. Look at this long term now. September 18 to 22, we're going to go back. To the heat, it's going to warm up. Some effect temperatures will be back above normal. And remember the heat out west? Well, they're going to be cool. A lot of times when it's cool there, it's hot in the east. And that's what we're going to see a flip in the weather pattern. As far as precipitation, probably at least near normal here in this area during that time period. So, forecast looks like this tonight. Then clouds now, but partial clearing as the night goes on. We'll drop down to 53. Then during the day for tomorrow, daytime high will hit somewhere in the upper 70s, 78 with partly cloudy skies. And then after that, temperatures are going to warm up with a lot of sunshine as we take you through the upcoming period. Matter of fact, by a week from now, we could be looking at highs in the upper 80s. And it looks like right now, a summer like weekend. Ahead for the valley. That's your forecast. Sports coming up right after the break.